Hi, using Podula, let us learn how to create a simple camera app for Android phones. And then we will also learn how to edit the image that we have taken. Let's get started. First, let us drag and drop camera component in the designer. And then create a button which will use it to open the camera. Let us give text for the button as take picture. To show the image that you have taken, let us create a simple image component. Drag and drop image component. Now go to the blocks and your first block should be when button one dot click. When it is clicked, you need to open the camera using call camera one dot take picture. This code opens up the camera of your phone, but it doesn't save the image yet. Let's see how it works. Take picture. And take the photo the error uh, the error says that the camera did not return nothing happens after we take picture so to view the image we will use the event when camera one dot after picture This event gives us the image file. Use this image to set it in our image component using set the image one dot picture to get image. Get get image from image and get image. Drop it there. Now, I would like to tell you that this is where Collider has a bug. Let's run the app and let's see what the bug is. Take the picture. Take it. The, uh, the error occurred. The camera did not uh, return the image. This is clearly a bug. This happens because Android is not creating a folder called pictures in the app folder. Cordula should have created this but it does not. So to fix this bug, create a global variable initialize image uh, underscore part with empty text and then insert this piece of code that I have got from Cordula discussion forum. First, create a variable that is the image path to empty text. And insert this piece of code that I have got it from the Cordula discussion forum. And also, the designer add file component anywhere. Anywhere. Now go to blocks and the ch uh, one uh, uh, and also one more change is when camera one dot after picture mm, remove the old code delete it and add this code set global variable 
is set global image path to get image and connect to that all right let's test this app take it take the picture take it and finally as you see when i click the button the camera opens and when i take the picture the image is shown in the designer in the screen now let's proceed to the next part of this tutorial we are going to edit the image that we have taken first go to the designer add a button and give the text as blur because i want to create blur effect next drag and drop image editor components anywhere now go to the blocks and insert a new block when button to dot click now drag and drop call image editor blur effect now set the image a as get global image path now there are two pa more parameters one is scale and the other is radius scale is to zoom in or zoom out radius is to tell how much blur effect is required let the scale be 1 put it to 1 1 is normal radius let us uh, let the radius be set as 10 we'll see how it will become for more later in the designer put image component below blur button and also type here set image to dot picture and put it over here and now let's see how we get the blur effect now first take the picture clear picture yeah now if we click blur what will happen it will blur the image correct great you can now change the radius to whatever number you want and see how it impacts let's meet next time with another tutorial happy coding friends